Good morning, hot dogs, and welcome to the morning announcements. This week is going by so slow. Slower than my mom's driving. Just kidding, you drive fast, mom. Today we'll be covering DECA applications, scholarships, and more. Now on to the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you are interested in applying to be on next year's Frankfurt DECA officer team, please pick up an application outside of the DECA room. Applications are available Wednesday, April 28th, and must be turned in to Mrs. Bishop no later than Friday, May 7th. The Abigail Pierce Commitment to Learning and Serving Scholarship is due tomorrow, and the AAA Scholarship is due Friday. Now to Sports with Violet. Good morning, everyone. The hot dog golf team traveled to the home course of the Tipton Blue Devils for a dual match yesterday afternoon. Strong wind gusts played havoc with many of the shots. Reese Mitchell with 43 led the dogs. Ramsey Mitchell with 50, Dakota Bailey with 52, and Trevor Meeks, 53, contributed to the final score. Jesse Reed and Mason O'Brien carded identical 56s. Coaches McKenzie and Kelly both mentioned improvement noticed in the play of these inexperienced players. Weather permitting the dogs traveled to Rocky Ridge take to take on the North Montgomery Chargers. The Lady Dogs softball team took the win over North Mont on yesterday, 18-1. The team totaled 19 hits, leading the Dogs with three hits apiece were Zoe Westerman, Kylie Wainscott, Karen Quinnes, and Katie Roberts. Kiyomi Perkins and Mikhail Harper each added two hits, and Autumn Bauer, Maddie Cook, and Tara Martinez each added one hit. Westerman led the team with three stolen bases along with Quinnes, Cook, and Perkins, each with two. Michaela Harper picked up the win, going five innings, allowing run run on the hits, striking out seven. The Lady Dogs are back at home today to host Northmont at 5.30 p.m. The Frankfurt girls tennis team played at Lafayette Jeff yesterday night. In one singles, Frankfurt Libby Pierce defeated Ashley Casey 6-3 and 6-4, and the rest of the team played a hard match. Frankfurt plays again at home on Thursday against Northmont. Good luck to you all. The boys competed at the Noblesville Invite against a very tough competition. Several boys did set a new personal records, including Angel Perez and Daniel Pritchett in the 1600, Jordan Henderson in the 400 and long jump, Garrick Burge in the 200, Josue Bautista Ventura and Marco Reyes in the 3200, Jacob Burns in the discus and shot put, and Kyle Earl in the shot put. The county's championship meet is at Frankfurt on Saturday at 9 a.m. That's all for sports today. Now back to your hosts. A reminder that there will be marching band practice tomorrow. This is for people who want to play and be a part of the marching band, but not march in the show. Take it into consideration to show up on Thursday from 4 to 5.30. You don't need experience, and I bet you'll enjoy it. The spring comedy show will be live tomorrow and Friday at 7. Everyone in attendance will be asked to wear a mask, and social distancing will be enforced. We ask if you plan to attend to show up early, as seating is limited. But here's the fun part. It's free. It's been over a year since the theater lights have come on, so please come out and support the cast and crew of this year's spring comedy. Again, seating is limited. Get there early. For lunch today, lines 1 and 2 will be cheeseburgers, and in lines 3 and 4, chicken strips. All lines will have chef salads and yogurts. Happy birthday to Elizabeth Nava Lopez. Have a good day. That's it for the announcements, hot dogs. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and have a great day.